Hi everyone, this video will show you how to update the software for iScan 3 and Vetus 3. First we need to power on the device by using the power supply adapter DC it was given inside the AutoLand case. Plug the output adapter into the device. Turn on the power supply. Wait for the device to power on. Connect the auto LAN to internet by using the pull down menu. The procedure to connect to the internet is same with a normal Android system. Okay. The internet is connected. Let's start the update. Go back to the main menu and press the update apps. If the update apps is found out outdated after the version check, it will automatically download and install the update apps first. Please wait. It will take approximately 1 to 3 minute depends on the internet speed. It is normal if it goes back to the main menu suddenly. Please press the update apps and enter one more time. Now the system is checking for the latest version. As you see the update is separate into three section. Apps, vehicle, and system. We need to make sure all the section is always up to date. Now we start on the apps first. These with green color update button is need to be updated. We can press the changes button to check what is the new features or changes on the latest version. Press the update button to update individually. You can cancel at any time if you have wrongly pressed or you wish to update in another time. The apps or software will install automatically once it finished downloaded. And it will not in the updates list anymore once it's successful installed or you can update all the app in one time by pressing the update all button. But it takes approximately 10 to 15 minutes only for all the apps in app section. For total times for all the three section update is approximately 30 minutes to 1 hours. But it still depends on the internet speed. The update for the app section is finished. That is no more update available on the updates list now. Let's go to the second update section, vehicle. In the vehicle update section, as you see the vehicle brand list with red color delete button on the right, is which means the vehicle brand is up to date. As usual, we can check what is the new features or new changes on the latest update by pressing the changes button. And we also can choose to update individually. or update all together. Please be patient and wait for all the update is finished. It might take longer time on vehicle update, but it still depends on how many brand need to update and the internet speed. Now the vehicle update section is finished. No more new update is available. All the vehicle brand software is the latest now. The last section, system. In the system section is to check update for the Android operating system, but this update is not always available. Press download and wait for the system to finish download. Once the download is finished, the system will ask for your permission to install. Before you press the update, always remember do not disconnect the power source during the installation. Any interrupting will cause system complete failure. If all the condition are met and ready, press the update. You will see the system will restart. And the Android logo will appear. Be always patient and do not interrupt the installation.
After the installation is finished, the system will restart one more time, and this time everything will boot up successfully. Okay. The auto land update is completed. If you have any question or problem on the update, please contact us. The contact number will appear at end of the video. Thanks for watching.